What just happened to ApeCoin? Will Ape ever recover? Hey, guys, hope you have been following our all videos. And if yes, then you must know that we predicted the ApeCoin surge when it was around $10, $12 and then it went all the way above $25, surging more than 100%. But now what happened to it is it's back to below $15. So in this today's video, we will tell you all about what happened around Apicoin. But before we get into the details, I would like to welcome you guys back in another video of our YouTube channel, TechHUB, where you will be always getting your daily dose of crypto news and entertainment. It is also important to note that I am not a financial advisor, and everything in this video is not financial advice. So let's start the video with an overview of the ApeCoin. You know it all started with the news that creator of ApeCoin and the most popular NFT club Yuga Labs are going to launch their own metaverse known as the other side, and the currency to be used in the metaverse will be ApeCoin. This helped ApeCoin to surge by over 100% in less than a week. They even sold out its other side metaverse project, which included 55 like other deed virtual land NFT, in three hours for $317 million. As we all know, Bake has been providing value to its NFT community through merch drops, make handle, ApeCoin, and other means since its inception two years ago. To begin, 100 other deed NFT were released, with 55 egg made available to pre-approved wallets. Over 27 people purchased the available NFT. The remaining 45 egg NFT will be airdropped to Bake and make holders at no additional cost. Those who were whitelisted, on the other hand, had to pay a flat fee of 305 ApeCoin for each NFT. However, due to the project's popularity, the other deed NFT minting caused gas fees to skyrocket to 8 quay and at one point, Ether scanned a crash. This gas war, on the other hand, benefited miners who earned $172 million in transaction fees. But then due to the news of this much high transaction fees, the Yuga Labs team announced the news that for some was good and for some was bad. And the news was that ApeCoin announced its integration with Ethereum. EDH sidechain Polygon, Matic after the recent Yuga Labs Other Deeds non-fungible token. NFT minting incident led to speculation about the new chain for APE, as their NFT drop encountered several issues, including pushing ETH gas fees to unprecedented highs. Users paid between 2 and 5 ETH for gas. As a result, users who failed to mint NFT but still paid ETH gas fees were outraged and expressed their displeasure on Twitter, with some even tweeting that they are withdrawing from their APE-related investments. While Yuga Labs promised to refund their gas, some users suspected that the failure was a planned marketing stunt, such as highlighting a problem before announcing a new APE chain. However, the ApeCoin DAO representative denied this, causing chaos and everything to go wrong for ApeCoin as some were not convinced and were still unhappy with the event's results. Then as the ape was decreasing on daily basis, how can somebody stop Elon Musk from getting into play with the sentiments or doing things he likes? ApeCoin APE saw a massive influx of capital into its market capitalization on May 4, when Elon Musk changed his Twitter profile picture to a collage of board apes. Soon after, ApeCoin soared from $14.49 to $17.49 in less than an hour, gaining up to 15%. Notably, the value of APE increased by nearly $1 billion during this period, rising from $4.13 billion to $4.98 billion before retracing. According to Wu Blockchain, Musk previously purchased Bay Cash 1837 for 569 ETH via MoonPay. Sotheby's co head of digital art Michael Balhenna, on the other hand, that Musk used an image of Bake as his profile picture without permission and hoped Musk would remove or credit the source or be willing to provide him with the original picture with the buyer's permission. And APE is now the 31st largest cryptocurrency with a market cap of less than $4 billion. Bearish price action has reduced the token's value by more than 65% since its all-time high of $39.40 in March 2022. Still, a few key narratives may add additional sell pressure on both APE and, as previously stated, the volatile price action behind APE is centered on the other deeds NFT mint over the weekend. Finally, while the number of trades in the NFT market has steadily increased, specific concerns within these ecosystems appear to be keeping APE under serious pressure. So let's see what happens to APE when Bitcoin goes up or down. So that's the end of the video, but still, if you have any questions about anything related to ApeCoin, so as I always say, do mention that below in the comment box. And also let us know if you think this new trend is going to go even higher or not. 
Now if you have found the content helpful then don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and do subscribe to our channel for weekly content like this. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video of Tech HUB. Until then, goodbye.